Hi everybody, I'm Lynn Fiddler. I am the new select board member for the town of Marshfield. I was born and raised here in Marshfield. I am one of four. My mom was a nurse and my father was in um, building. When we were kids, my father had, um, I don't even remember the situation, but came home with a little Shetland pony. And so we had a couple little ponies and a field behind the house. It was an orchard and there were, um, there were grapevines and pear trees and all sorts of great places to hide. And there was Bowles' Pond, which I don't know if this generation would know what that is, but that's down off of Ferry Street on the corner. And we would be allowed on rare occasions to take the ponies down to Hummer Rock over the bridge and then go out onto the beach. And occasionally we'd be allowed to take the horses over to the bridle path. And they were, you know, like this. Um, so that started when we were kids and it's resonated in through my life. And now my sister has a horse and it's just a passion. So I began, I have a degree from the University of Vermont in sociology. I, and that was a weird thing too, because I really didn't know what I, I was one of those, I really didn't know what I wanted to do. So UVM, UNH, you know, Bates, all those types of places. I just ended up in a degree in sociology because it was the end to all and I, I really honestly went through, through school not having that aha moment. So I did some work in the women's battered shelter in Burlington and North Burlington and that drove it home for me that how important it is to have this type of, of field that people can help and and be there for people in crisis. And then when I graduated from college, I, I recall it was actually a funny thing. My father said, are you gonna get a job? And I said something to the effect, well, I'll get a job. And I looked through the paper, cause that's what you did then. You circled with a marker and you looked through your paper and I had a job on Wednesday. So I ended up in public publications and I sold typesetting and drove around Boston. And then I did some work in the environmental field in publications. So I was used to working with traffic engineers and soil scientists and did a lot of the MWRA in Boston Harbor Cleanup and things like that in the, in the firm that I was working for. So, and then had babies and came to Marshfield. So three babies, I, I went back to work for two and a half years or, and then tried it a little bit longer having the two kids at home with, um, and it was just, it was just time for me to make a decision. I couldn't do both, both mothering and the professional side and do it like I needed to do it. So I decided to quit <laughs> my job and become what is my most important job and that's being the mother to my three kids. So my son went to Mass Maritime and my daughter went to Johnson and Wales and my other daughter is, a, is also um, here in Marshfield and she went to Sacred Heart University and they are, they are just amazing. And I don't, I can't believe, cause I really don't talk about, because I get myself all worked up, but I, um, I don't know how I would be in this life without them. So yeah, that's it with my kids and my family because I get, and my mom and my brothers and, and all the whole group. And I usually do a speech or some sort of a toast on Thanksgiving and I cry every year because every year there's something new that's happened to this group and, and I am, I'm just amazed by my nieces and nephews and, and all the important things that they're going to be doing in their lives. Yeah. Part of being in this town, there are so many, so many families and um, neighbors and neighborhoods that are so full of, I want to say passion, but they also have this grit about them. And um, I'm recognizing that more so now in this role as select board member. And 
I love everything. I I love the different the different landscapes and the and the ability to get in your car and get to the beach and push a stroller down a path and have all the folks you know that's that see you here and there in Marshalls or at the grocery store or all these different things and and being part of this community is is the backbone of who I am and I know that my family feels the same way I could never imagine moving we are we are we were born here we are gonna die here but um, my family we are so incredibly lucky to have this town and each one of us live here and have raised our children here so yeah we are we are what you would call townies and it's not just that it's cousins and best friends and all of that so yeah that's who who I am and who we are yeah